mom and things happen and just the kids going back to school full time and getting used to their new routines. They go to different schools and when my, when my oldest takes the bus, my youngest I have to pick up and drop off, traffic and just trying to get back into the swing of regular life, I guess. I mean, you know, because before they were at home, so I had time when I thought I didn't have time and now they're in school and I still feel like I don't have time. But I found some time today to check out a different Dollar Tree that I haven't been to and I've been dying to go to for a while. I'm always saying I want to check that Dollar Tree out because it looks like they, it's big, it's huge. I didn't get any walkthrough footage just because I was kind of just feeling it out for myself. Next time I go, I will get some walkthrough footage, but I got so many goodies, you guys, and I can't wait to show you guys everything that I got. Um, I'm so excited to be back, so we're going to start with this bag. Again, this is a cumulative haul of my stuff and my parents' stuff. They came with me because I wanted them to come. I hate going shopping by myself, so anyway, so the first thing I got from this bag is um, a pack of bounty paper towels. I just got one. This is going to go in my car. I have like a little basket in my car for like things like this because you know when you got kids and you go out anything can happen and napkins paper towels all that is great to have so I got a pack one of those to put in my car I also got some of these by Coltex they're the panty liners I've never seen this brand well at my normal Dollar Tree I've never seen this brand I went to this Dollar Tree and they had this brand I picked them up because you know we're ladies um, I also found a lot of good books here. I'm actually able to go through the books at this Dollar Tree because the one I normally go to, the books are up high. So a lot of times I can't really go through them. But this, this Dollar Tree, the books are down low. Y'all know I'm a little person, I'm small. So it's, it was easier for me to go through the, the books. So I got some books for my little, my youngest son. Y'all yeah, know he loves Mickey Mouse. So I got him his Mickey Mouse book. Um, and then I found these. Oh my God, I love Snoopy, the peanuts, all of that. That's like my favorite. I watch all the holiday specials every year and I make my kids watch them too. So I got these for my little one too. They're so cute. They're like the ready to read books. I got all the ones that I found, all the different ones. So I'm just gonna open one up so you can kind of see the inside of them. Definitely check the books out, you guys. These are great for early reading learners. So I got those. And then I found this little storybook, which maybe my oldest son, he's 10, but he might like to read it or, it's a good book. It's like an actual storybook. It doesn't say how much, none of this stuff retail, but I figured um, they have a little library in their room, like a little bookshelf. I call it their little library. So, you know, I like to always add new books to it. Um, then I got also for my car, because it's good to have these things. Again, I got a Kleenex. I bought two packs. The other one must be over there somewhere. So I got um the little packs of tissues because these are good you just throw them in like the little side things of your car and the side compartments and you always got clean next somebody got a runny nose or a sneeze or whatever i also got for my car also some clorox wipes because you never know and some baby wipes it might be saying why are you so extra my son plays football and sometimes they play at fields where there's no toilet paper and no bathrooms so it's good to have the baby wipes um i also got um these little hair um bobby pins i liked them because of the jewels um i cut my hair short you can't really tell because it's up right now and 
you know, it'd just be cool to wear my hair right now since it's short. I also got the boys these little sandwich containers. There's, they have Marvel characters. I mean, my kids aren't really into the Marvel, but I got them because they've been taking sandwiches to school, so it, this is better for their lunch boxes. So I got these. Um, and then I found one of these. I have. I had hauled one of these last year from my youngest son and I use it all the time and I've been on the lookout for, for some new ones. I'm sorry, y'all, I keep scratching, but it's because I got a mosquito bite coming in the house, so it <laughs> itches. Um, so I've been looking for these and I couldn't find them and they had them at this Dollar Tree, so I got him a blue one. The one other one he got is orange. So other things that we got, um, these little strawberry filled muffins. Don't know if they're good, but we're gonna try them. This ginger gingerbread oatmeal, like the little oatmeal packets. I hear these are good. Like from this brand, I hear they're good. So I've tried those. Um, got two, two of the packs of of um cookies small packs chocolate chip and sugar cookie because sometimes you know you get into that i want to eat something hot uh type of um mood like bake something so got that i also got this it's a shaving brush but i give my kids haircuts um the bonnie my little son he always gets a haircut at home because He's autistic and sometimes it's hard for me to, I'm not entirely comfortable taking him to a barber shop and you know, I know people should be more inclusive, I get that, but it's just, I don't want to inconvenience people to dealing with a child who might not want to sit still, so we always give him a haircut. And I usually use these to clean the hair off of their neck, so that's what that is. Um, I also got these little pit combs, these are good because you can part hair with this and you know they seem pretty decent pretty hard you know so got those um um hold on a second y'all um we also got more of these um of the of the um oatmeal Packets, pumpkin spice, and hot chocolate. My dad's very adventurous, so <laughs> he'll have to try those before I do. Um, I also got these. I've got them before, and I really like them. They're a fun, quick snack to do with your kid. You know, if you guys are bored or want to have a movie night, and y'all just don't want to go for the traditional popcorn, I had got these little mug treats. They're really easy and actually really tasty. So I bought four, um, two of each. I got, this one is rainbow chip cake. And this one is hot fudge brownie. So I got two of each of those. So something for me and me and my son, my older son, because my, my younger son might not like it, but my older son, so I'm for me and him to do. Um, and I also got these, the fudge mint. I, I hear they're like the knockoff of the thin mints from the Girl Scouts. I'm going to try it, and I'm going to let you know. Matter of fact, I might try one now, just because. Just because. So... Let's open the box. Okay, let's see how they come. So they come like this. I guess it's very similar to the Girl Scout ones. Let me open it up for you guys. And I'm gonna try one. And I'll tell y'all if it tastes like the Girl Scout ones. So good. 
This is just like the Girl Scout Thin Mints. Except I think the Girl Scout Thin Mints are black on, um, chocolate on the inside. Those are like white. Still good. Really, really good. Alright, so that's those two bags. Also got definitely check your containers at Dollar Tree. They have a lot of really good containers out right now. Um, these are one of them. They're really good. I've bought them before here in the house. They come in different colors. There's a gray one, like this, a pink one. This is the green. They bring it's three contain three different size containers for a dollar, and they're very sturdy and very good um, quality. Definitely recommend these. We got some more for the house, but I definitely recommend those. Also, these bars of soap right here, this specific brand, I don't know how to say it, and this kind is my favorite, the, euca the charcoal eucalyptus, it smells really good, and these bars of soap are huge. Like, when I tell you they're huge, they're big. So, definitely worth the dollar. Some of my other favorite things to get from Dollar Tree. Um, other things are, my dad got some mothballs. Uh, I don't really know what he uses them for, but he got mothballs. I love bugs. Oh, so we the bugs. You wanna keep some bugs away. Then we got a few bags of these stones. I'm not gonna pull them all out because there's a lot of them. Yeah, I know I got a kitten a few months back in the spring. He's big now. He's pretty big. But he's also bad. So he's a good kitten. He's just, you know, he's, he's mischievous. He's in his little kitten mischievous phase. And he likes to go into our, we got lots of plants in my house. And he likes to go and into the dirt of the plants and dig all the dirt out, all the soil. So we got those. We found that. Those help him not want to dig, so that's why we bought the um the rocks for. So he won't he won't dig. Here you go. So he won't take the dirt out of him anymore. Um, other things we got is this 12 month farmers market calendar for the next the next year for 20. 2021 for 2022. I mean, um, here's it has it's like really cute. Like on the back, look at all the pictures it has. You scan it slow so y'all can see everything. So we got that because you know this year done flew by, you guys. I forgot to mention that I'm coming up this month on a year of my channel. Yeah, I can't believe I've been doing this for a whole year, you guys. I just thought about it right now, too. I started around this time last year because I remember when September, my kids had started um, school and my son was still in football. So it's been a year, you guys, a whole year. So how, how, how nice is it that I'm celebrating the year with you guys by going to Dollar Tree? I also got these pretty picks. I love these. They also have a lot of Christmas picks out. Y'all really need to go and check. Y'all dial two for the Christmas picks. Um, my sister-in-law gave me like some pretty like pumpkin leaf picks. I added some footage in the beginning of the video of just like some of my fall decor that I put out. Most of it came from Dollar Tree, um, if not all. But the one little vase is kind of sad, so. We got this to, you know, spruce it up a little bit. Um, I haven't finished decorating. Maybe I'll do like a little decorate with me or just so you can see some of my ideas or whatever type of video. Um, some, some kind of different content instead of just always Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. But I know y'all love Dollar Tree just as much as I love Dollar Tree. Then we got some of these little pot, uh, pot holders. We had the same ones last year. My mom kind of just used them a lot, so we got some fresh ones for the fall. 
Um, these are more rocks. Um, over here, we got another bag of this bag of popcorn. This is our favorite popcorn, the movie theater butter. We love this popcorn. It's so good, so addicting. Great for a movie night. Definitely our favorite popcorn. And my mom got some Whoppers. Um, I got some cookies for the boys. So I've been not trying to buy like really huge snacks for them because sometimes they don't eat everything. So honestly, that's enough for them. Um, we got a shower liner. Um, plates, we got two packs of throwaway plates, uh, disposable, whatever you want to call them. Can't go wrong with those because ain't nobody in the mood for dishes all the time. Um, over here, whoo, I told you guys, this is a, a big haul. I, I think this is like the most I've bought in Dollar Tree probably in most of the summer, honestly. Uh, one of these, the little Swiffer things, these are so good. They just like the, they're like a dupe of the, the Swiffer Sweeper type mops. It's the same thing. You put it on, you buy the, the pole from the, the brooms that they have. It fits on here. And then they sell the little pads that you can put here. Or you can buy the little Swiffer pads and stick them in these holes. Works just the same. Um, one of these little rugs, see, look, I'm going to show you. You put it on here, you put your product on the floor, you put this on here, you wet this, obviously, and that's how that works. With, obviously, the stick. Um, some toothpaste, some Ajax, look at this big old thing of Ajax for a dollar. Um, these are bonus bonus sizes, so anytime you see a bonus size, definitely get it because they're basically full size products. Sometimes Dollar Tree doesn't sell full size. Um, this um, um, this leather interior protectant that I use for my car. Um, this for the wheels, if to shine your wheels and your rims, it works really good. I've used it other times. I like it. Um, a palm olive. And some baby oil cream that my dad got for himself. And some shampoos and conditioners. I got this one. is the Vanilla Blossom Almond. I don't know how it smells, but it smells good. It smells good from Suave. And these two, this is Sun Bright and Strawberry. I got it too. And then onto my, wait, I want to smell this one too. Mmm, it smells good. So Sun Bright and Strawberry. Then onto the last and final bag, you guys, the grand finale. <laughs> I got uh, some of these big old canvases for me and my son. I hardly ever find this size at my um, other dollar store. I went, they had a really big size, and I thought it would be fun to do like a little paint night. So I got four of them for me and him to do together. Um, I also found this pack of socks for myself. Now, this brand right here, these socks are so good if you see them at dollar tree grab them they're really good super good quality i got them for, i got a pack for my youngest ones and my oldest i got him a few pairs when i tell you i wash them and i wash them and they always come out looking like this i mean it definitely great quality socks so i had to get me some so i got that i also got these i love the way these smell and I like them, you know, especially when you want to freshen up after a really hot day. Um, they're women's deodorant wipes with aloe vera by Global Beauty Care. I got two packs. I really like those. 
Um, I also got my son the, the little cup to go with his little tray. Look at how cute. Oh, I love, I love stuff like this. It's so cute. So, I can't wait for him to see that. So, I got that for my little one. I also got this J. Uh, this little pumpkin. Um, most There's mostly J's in my house. Like, my dad's name starts with a J. Both my son's names start with J. So, I got this J. Um, I called a P, an uh, orange one with the P. Our last names start with P. So, I got the P. But this is the J in the order to my sons and my father. And this is like the more of the white, like wood looking pumpkin. The other one I got is orange. I'm like, again, I said, I took some footage of some of my decor, so you'll see it in there. I also called this body wash by Zest Fresh Aqua to body wash. I love body washes. This one smells so good. Um, so me and the kids or whoever wants to use it can use it. it smells really good. I just got some on my hand by accident. Oh, here goes the other pack of Kleenex that I told y'all about. And I bought two. Of, uh, I bought two of these. I don't know if one got left at the store or is in here. But one of these little magic -y towels. This is Minnie. I mean Mickey for my youngest son. And then the last thing is this Hershey's Morris uh, flavor lip gloss. I've been obsessed with buying all the flavor lip glosses at Dollar Tree. So I got this one. It's it's supposed to be marshmallow flavored. And I don't know if you can tell if it's yellow and it has like glitter in it. I don't know if you forgot to see it. The glitter. But yeah, I'm gonna try it out, out now just because why not, right? I like trying out stuff with you guys. It's fun. It gives me a reason to open it up earlier than I normally would. So let's open this up. So it's little. I like the container, the packaging is so cute. Look at it. Then I'm gonna tell you how it smells. It does smell like like marshmallow. It doesn't taste like anything to me. But overall, I like it. So, yeah, that's my haul. That's everything I got. Um, yeah, and I hope y'all enjoyed this. I'm glad to be back. I'm going to try real hard to make more regular content. You guys, please be patient with me. Um, but either way, thank you for sticking out with me for a whole year of my little YouTube journey. I really appreciate all of you guys, and thank y'all for everything. Love y'all. Bye.